Good everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix mouse cursor not locking to game in Windows machine. If the mouse cursor is not locking to the game on your PC, you need to first update the game and operating system and then follow the suggestion. Now to update the game, you will have to open the respective game which you're playing and then update the game. To update the operating system, you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on setting. Once you are on the settings page on the left hand side, you will have to go ahead and click on Windows update and uh, you would see an option for your Windows update. See if there are any updates to be installed, click on it. What your Windows will do is it, your Windows will go ahead and check for the updates and see if there are any updates to be installed. Once you see the list of updates to be installed on the computer, you would have an option to install those updates. Once the installation is done, you may close this window restart your computer and check if your issue has been resolved. If your issue has been resolved, you don't need to try the next step. What you will have to fix the problem is to go ahead and restart the game or the launcher. Restarting the game or the launcher you are using, this will remove the glitch that could have caused this issue. So go ahead and restart them and finally check if the issue has been resolved. In case if it resolved, you don't need to try the next step. The next method is to go ahead and reset game bar. If you use Xbox game bar when playing the game there is slightly a possible chance that the program is either corrupted or misconfigured in that case our best bet is to reset or repair the game bar to do so you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on settings on the left hand side you will see an option for system click on system and on the right hand side you will have to go ahead and look for system components click on the system component and in this you will see an option for game bar click on the three dotted lines or ellipses and then click on advanced option under this you will have to click on terminate and then click on repair once the repair is complete you may also want to go ahead and click on reset now when you do a reset please make sure that you have your login credentials for your game bar available on your screen it might prompt you for your login credentials so you may click on reset once the reset is complete you may close this window restart your computer and check if your issue has been resolved in case if your issues is resolved, well and good, you don't need to try the next step. Now the next method is to go ahead and enable LUA. Even though limited user account controls the user access control feature, due to a bug, it can affect the mouse cursor as well. So you will have to go ahead and enable LUA. Now to do this, you will have to open registry editor. You can do a right click on the start button and then click on run. In the run window, you may go ahead and type reg edit and then click on OK. In case if you get a user access control prompt, you may click on yes or continue on the screen. Once you have the registry editor open on your computer the first thing what I would suggest you to do is to take a backup of the registry by clicking on file at the top left corner and then click on export choose the location where you want to take a backup give a name and click on save once this is done in case if you want to restore the registry you, you will have to click on file and then click on import and that go to the location where you have saved the backup file and then from there you can go ahead and restore the uh, registry so this is how you can take a backup and restore the registry once the backup is complete you will have to navigate to the location under hk local machine expand hk local machine then expand software under software you will have to go ahead and look for microsoft expand microsoft by clicking on the arrow and then look for windows expand windows and then current version under under current version you will have to look for policies expand policies and then look for system once you have highlighted system on the left hand side to the right hand side you will have to look for l u a you will have to do a right click and then click on modify in case if the value data has been set to one you will have to go ahead and change to zero and click on ok in case if the value data is zero you will have to change from zero to one so either ways you will have to go ahead and change the values once this is done you may go ahead and close the registry editor, restart your computer for the changes to effect and then check if your issue has been resolved. In case even after this, if you're still seeing this issue. Now the next step is to go ahead and update the mouse driver or the touchpad driver. To do this, you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on device manager. Once you have the device manager open, you will have to go ahead and look for mice and other pointing device. Go ahead and expand it. Choose the drivers which are currently installed on the computer. In case if you have an external mouse, you will see the list of drivers here. You might want to 
update the drivers for all the components here so you can do a right click and then click on update driver search automatically for the drivers and then click on close and then you can also choose hid compliant mouse do a right click and then click on update driver search automatically for the drivers and then click on close and same thing applies for all the components listed here now once uh, you can also try updating the driver from the windows component as well so you can do a right click update driver search automatically for the drivers in case if you see this message you can also choose the option which says search for the updated drivers on windows update this should check for the uh, driver updates through the windows component check for the updates see if there are any updates to be installed in case if there are updates to be installed go ahead and install them and at the same time before you restart your computer go to the advanced option and then go to the optional updates and see if there are any optional updates available for your computer in case if there are any optional updates go ahead and install them close this window restart your computer and check if your issue has been resolved now in case if your issue is resolved you don't need to try the next step now the next method is to go ahead and disable the mouse precision on your computer to do this you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on setting once you are on the settings page you will have to go ahead and click on bluetooth and devices now on the right hand side you will have to go ahead and click on mouse under this section you will have to click on additional mouse settings this should open the mouse properties window and then click on pointer options under pointer option you will have to go ahead and uncheck the box for enhance pointer precision so uncheck the box click on apply and then click on ok and then check if your issue has been resolved so all these steps should definitely fix the problem so in spite of trying all this step if you're still facing a problem i would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that i can come up with the possible solution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.